Hey everybody, welcome back to Dirty Water, Coins and Collectibles. Uh, tonight I figured we could go through one of those silver dime rolls that I picked up in Vermont. And before I started the video, I noticed that right there. It looks like we have a copper edge. That's all right. So let's see what we got in here. This one right there. That looks old. So that's uh, two, four, six, eight, the tenth coin down. So let me get the tripod set up and uh, we'll see what we have in here for coins and dates. It says that it's all Roosevelt's, but I have purchased rolls up there before. And uh, there were Mercury's. I think one of them had a bobber in it. But let's crack it open and find out. Be right back. All right. Got the top off. Let's see. What is this one? 1948. Huh, that's weird. That one looked like it was copper. Let me check out this roll here. Huh. <clears throat> All right, so we have 1948 out of Denver. <clears throat> 1963 out of Denver 1961 out of Philly 1st year 1946 out of Philly what was this one over here? That first one was a 48. We'll put that over here. Let me move these to the side. All right, next is 1954. And some cool toning on there. Out of Philly. What's this? 1965 out of Philly 63 61 65 what do you got here 1948 out of San Fran that's nice 48 and Oof, that's seen better days. 1952, out of Philly. 1964, out of Denver. 1947. Out of Denver. We got 47. Nineteen sixty-four out of Philly. Nineteen sixty out of Philly. 1961 Philly 1962 Denver 1953 out of Philly 
1957 out of Denver. Fifty-four out of Denver. Sixty-four Philly. Fifty-nine Denver. <clears throat> 1950 out of Denver 63 Philly 59 Philly 1958 out of Denver. Some of these coins have some nice toning. 63. Denver. 1960. Out of Denver. 57 Philly 57 Another first year 46 out of Denver A good uh, variety of dates 1950 out of Philly 51 Philly What's going on right in here? Is this a clash die? Huh, I'll have to look at these 64 Denver 61 Denver 52 Denver 53 Denver 47 out of Philly. Mm -hmm. All right, sorry about that pause. My son got out of the shower speaking in a British accent. What is up with this? 1950 Philly with some schmutz on there. We have 1956. Philly, some cool toning on there, 57, 59, 58, okay, next, we have another 1957 out of Philly, 1961, out of Philly. <clears throat> we have nineteen fifty two out of Philly. We have almost every date. Fifty seven Philly. Nineteen fifty. Not in bad shape. Philly. <clears throat> 64 out of Philly 1948 
out of San Francisco. That's nice. Need a 49. 1964. Philly. Another first year. Wow, that one's in good shape for a first year. Out of Philly. Another first year. 46. Philly, 62, Denver, 50s, 60s, where's my 52, here we go, was this a 52, I had it with the 62s, 52, Okay, another 52, Philly, 48, Philly, 64, Philly, and last but not least, 1962. Out of Philly. All right. Let me take this off the tripod and I'll get you back in, show you our dates. I'm going to go through some of these, see if I can find any errors. This one's really nice in terms of toning. That's a cool looking dime. This one was pretty nice too, looking at it. Okay. Give me a second, let me take this off the tripod, and I'll bring you in for the dates. All right, so we have our 1946s, 47s, 48s, no 49s. We have 50s. 51, 52, 153, a couple 54s, no 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, we have 60, 61, 62, 63, and more 63s and 64. So we have just about every date except for 49 and 55. I'm going to go through some of these, see if there's any errors or mint mock varieties. If I find something, I'll bring you in and show you. We did have a 1965. That's got to be the copper one that I saw. Yeah. Okay. That's the copper. I'm going to continue looking for the errors. This one's actually in pretty nice shape, though. Look at that. It's a nice 1965. All right, let me continue on this error journey. I'll bring you back in if I find something. All right, well, that's it for the hunt. Um, this 1965 is pretty clean. Would you guys keep it? Or would you put it in your return change and just bring it back to the bank? It's a really, it's a nice looking 1965. First year of clad. I'll show you the reverse. I mean, it's really not, not too much wrong with it.
Mr. Shannon Smith, what would you do? Is it kind of just a run of the mill? All right, and then the find for this roll for me is this 1956 toned rosy. I just like the color on this one. It looks nice. And again, this one's not in bad shape for a 56. I was looking at the top of the torch there. I don't think it's doubled, but the reverse isn't as nice as the obverse. But no, I think that's just the toning. But I mean, all in all, that's a that's a nice looking coin. I like the toning. I'm a tone fan, as most of you know. It's got some good color to it. Not really showing up on screen here. Kind of come down at an angle, maybe. Here we go. The colors are nice. All right, well, that's our hunt. $45 roll of silver. I'll take that all day, every day. We did get one 1965 out of there, but really, I'm not going to complain about that. That's a beautiful coin. All right, that's it for the hunt. If you made it through this whole thing, please uh, consider subscribing if you haven't done so already. Hit that notification bell so you get notified on all of my hunts. I do have another roll of silver dimes to go through. And uh, hit that like button. Helps the channel get views and make its rounds through YouTube. See you on the next one.